if you hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, you're going to be missing out on videos and free prizes and raffles we have coming up. This video includes timestamps, so check out the description below if you want to bounce ahead and just grab the info that you want. Hey friends, I want to make a quick little video about uh, center stand, side stand maintenance. And so real quick, let's look at this clip that I, I've already fixed it, but I used it for an Instagram story. So take a look at this clip on how this was sticking and me fixing it real quick. Here's something that's quite often um, overlooked on maintenance and that is lubricating up the kickstand. So this one here is really kind of kind of lazy. I got on a lot of foremans looked at it, looked at it, and a lot of people were complaining about the spring. And I've seen this happen from a, a couple different ways. The mounting bolt, which goes through there, I've seen just impacted like crazy and caused that kind of stick. And this isn't too bad. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in here and try and just uh, lubricate it up and see uh, see if I get any improvement out of that. Just from simple maintenance. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. It comes up all on its own, just a little maintenance. Here's the danger of this. If this drag stays down because it's just stuck, you take a chance of that foot, you know, catching in the concrete or something could actually flip the motorcycle. So stupid dangerous if you don't uh, maintain your vehicles there. All right, pretty cool. Uh, wasn't the mounting of it. It was a simple just uh, maintenance item and it's gonna make the bike much safer for the customer. But I'm gonna go ahead now and do the side stand one. Now let's get back in here and uh, lubricate this up. This is one that's sticking as well can see that we're going to see if we can get uh get that a little bit better okay not even going to take anything apart all i'm going to do is just it's already fixing it okay i'll try and find that that spot in here get around okay you can see my can hear the switch actually working and functioning now, so I want to work that around there. And that's what we want. See, we want it to really snap down, and we want it to really snap up. So need a little more on the up. Getting a lot of rust out of there. Now the ideal way would be to take it apart and uh, really clean it up, clean up the bolt. Notice I keep testing my work over and over and over till it works right. So you see that spot that it's still stopping or sticking. So keep doing it until it's fixed. So right here where that spring's as straight as can be, that's the point. We want to be past that to where as we kick it up. And another way to kind of do this here is just see how it's working with your foot. I might have to take it apart. Let's see. I think this backside one. This bike was in a little tip over too, and sometimes that can be the problem. Look at all the shit that's coming out of here. Now what I want to do is make sure. I don't have any catchy spots from the from the accident here. There we go. All right. There we go. Fixed. All right, my friends. There you have it. Just a couple of quick maintenance tips to. Uh, make your life, uh, life easier, make your bike safer, and make it all uh, more enjoyable. I've uh, done a couple of videos on this bike recently. You might want to check them all out. If you're not a subscriber, you can check out all the most uh, recent videos. And especially if you have CBR 500R, you're going to dig them. Anyway, as always, make sure and like, share, subscribe. Join the channel if you, if you can to support us. Make it a great day. And as always, keep wrenching. Hey, friends. We're super excited to announce that the How to Wrench channel has been approved for memberships. What's that mean for you? What would it look like if you could get member-only content? 
Many of you have been asking over the last year as we've put out surveys and, and tried to get some feedback that you missed the old deep dive long videos and the, the real uh, explain content. Those are very hard to produce and they're very costly. They take an immense amount of time, especially to make it uh, creative and interactive for you to get that deep understanding. We have a lot of schools, institutions, do-it-yourselfers. I mean, really people from all over the world, over 200 countries, are using our content to get a deep understanding to uh, help themselves or to advance in their career. Well, those videos are coming back. That's the kind of content that's gonna go in this membership channel because we can offset some of those costs. So that's one, you're gonna get the deep dive videos. Two, you're gonna get access to member-only streams and live chats to where you can actually call in, ask questions and get answers on the spot and have a, a back and forth uh, Q&A session with other members as well. We're super excited about that. And with the member, channel it's going to really make it more intimate we're going to be able to bring that back into more of a of a community instead of all the yahoos out there that are just causing trouble and being idiots this community has always been about helping each other and uh getting those answers to the questions we need i mean you, you gotta remember i love youtube too when i want to learn something it's quite often one of my first go-to places to get information or to learn something that i'm trying to do so we, we love that we can do this for you as well and we just want to make this of a community that is, is more attentive. So we wanna be more relationship focused. That's a big thing of the memberships. The other thing is, uh, YouTube does this, I think it's kind of funny, but uh, we're doing the emojis. So if you're a new member, it's gonna be a green one. We kind of went along the lines of like uh, training does in most uh, certification programs. Bronze is your entry level, uh, silver is your middle of the road, and then gold is your you know top certified. But we added one more. We added a red one just to say, hey, thanks for all the love after you've been here for a while. So for all you that love that kind of stuff, hey, it's there for you. Um, what else are you going to get with this? What you're going to get is really honestly, in my opinion, it's really a way just to say thank you. We've tried really hard over the years to figure out creative ways to not beg, if you will, but to try and encourage and remind people that, hey, I, I got a full-time job. Like I do this and have always done this on my own buck. All these expenses are my own. Uh, as I move to this new location, Phoenix, it's really expensive. We got a building, insurance, uh, you know, it, we got everything. So uh, it costs a lot to be able to do all this. And we really do need your help to offset some of that. So this is a way for you to really easily just say thank you and create that, you know, like I said, that deeper relationship with us as well to get the answers that you want and you need. So with that being said, I hope this has caught your attention. I hope you thought, man, that's really a great idea. Uh, look at the options below on the join. You hit that join button. It'll tell you what tiers. You can figure out what works best for you and what attracts you. It's a great way to get some uh, discounts on merchandise as well too. But hey, we are going to get back at it. We're super excited about this. We're just already going to start moving forward making content that's member only. So those, those videos we were just talking about. But my friends, whatever you're doing, be safe. We know 2020 has been a crazy year out there. So I hope that you're working on something that's making you smile or that you're getting through it or that's making you money. So we're going to get back at it. But as always, make it a great day and keep wrenching.